Welcome to RHCE series of lectures. In this lecture, we will set up SMTP server, and in the next lecture, we will set up SMTP null client. We will use the IPA server that we configured earlier and set it up as SMTP server. verify the service status the service should be enabled and should be running open the configuration file for postfix the file name is man.cf set up the mentioned values on the website educatorhome.com first we set up the host name host name will be ipa.example.local now set up my domain that will be example.local my origin either you can keep it as my origin equals to dollar my domain or you give the domain name over here both have the same meanings it can be any of these two so we will keep only one INET interfaces on which interfaces this machine will be listening we will be listening on all the interfaces INET protocols is all <coughs> whether we can set it to IPv4 or v6 if you put it all then it will be listening on all the protocols at the moment we need IPv4 my destination should be my host name comma localhost dot my domain localhost comma my domain check for any syntax errors with postfix check command if there are any syntax errors it will display over here this will show the values under the man.cf file We need to allow SMTP under the firewall so that the client machines can access SMTP services from this server.
<coughs> After all the configurations, we need to restart the Postfix service. After the restart, we see the status if the service is running. We can send a test mail from the local machine. So we need to take the logs on a separate terminal. While we are sending the email, we can see the behavior of the email and on the logs. So we will take real time logs by running this command var log mail log with minus f switch. This will be opened on one terminal and from the second terminal we will try to send the email. We can send a test email via this command. And the mail will be sent to user root at example.org. He says the mail command not found. So we need to install the packages that provide the mail command. The package name is mailx. Let us see what's the name of the package. Now the mail command is present with the mail x package. Give this run this command and we will see under the log it says status is equal to sent and delivered to mailbox. Give the command mail and see all the mails available to the user root. And this is the email that we sent last time. This was the test email. In the next lecture, we will set up NFS SMTP null client. Thank you for watching this lecture.